Okay. Let's play some Kirby. Now. Doing some secret stuff and other things. Bruh. Yeah, it's the Mario with the guns. Super Gangster Mario. We might dodge the last ones we need. That doesn't even make sense, I'll fill in. What the heck is wrong with you? Yep. I was thinking about that a second ago. Gotta get my hammer. Yo. Oh, crap. Let me just do this. Maybe I should put this a little bit closer. Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot about Among Us Kirby. Okay. Yo. So I guess I can only do that once, huh? Probably. Whoops. Oh wow, five of them? It's a lot. Also, fair. Yo. Yo. The hammers are all crashed, too. That looks pretty cool. Oh, there's a new treasure road? Yo, they can shoot fire. Oh, he does a spin now. And it's a lot faster than- Oh my god, the hammer flips. Charges fast. And... I imagine, yeah, you can get a lot more range out of it, so now it's an even, an actually viable attack to not just, like, sit there and wait to stand in one place to hit it, because now you can move around. Wow, the fire makes it so much more viable. Wait, really? What do you mean, toy hammer? What about this hammer? Wow. No. Wait. Can you power up each one individually? It's kinda sussy. Aww. Dang. Oh, you can get them at the Coliseum. Bruh, are you kidding me? You got the up Okay. Oh, wait, so it's the flip on this one, not as strong? I, I want to upgrade them all, but it probably won't be on stream. I'll probably just upgrade my favorites when I can. Oh my god, you kidding me? I have to grind the Meta Knight Cup? I mean, I can also just... Go to the, um, what's it called? Um, to get the presents. Eh, that's fine. I like multiple heads. Oh, let's do this. Mass ten oh man, that's a long trial. That's gonna be a hard one. A post-game trial. 
I was an enemy gauntlet, that's why it's so long. It's like my favorite song in the game, not gonna lie. Oh, what the? I can do three of them? Oh man, I don't even know what to do. Hey there, CF! Boom! Ah, oh, crap! Ah, uh, I'm not gonna get the time if that guy's eating me! Stop eating me! Just stop! There is no eating allowed on this stream. You must starve. I'm sorry. Oh my god. These guys are so annoying. I'll be right back. Back. Had to go and sneeze. Okay, that didn't help much. I hate the frickin' snake. I'm not sure what to do other than hammer flip everywhere. Yeah, allergy season's terrible, man. I'm dying over here. Okay, I'll just use this. Probably better than using the hammer spin right now. I'm just trying to use the spin and the hammer, like fire, because the range will help me get all these enemies that are around me. That was a little unnecessary, but funny. Just the hammer alone is good enough anyway. This gosh darn snake. There's so many enemies, oh my gosh. How am I supposed to beat this in time? Yeah, I didn't have to feed those little enemies. Yo.
Oh, what? Uh... Okay, I don't know. Math hammer for her strategy. I'll look it up. Yeah, I don't really know how to do this one that much better. I mean, maybe I can do a little better. Yeah. It's gonna be a long stream. Oh yeah, I forgot I can do it easier by holding the button. Okay, that will speed up my time significantly. Also, I like how they home in. guys have wasted at least like 10 seconds of my whole life. Yeah, the fires kill the little monkeys, but the snakes have to be defeated with more care. Screw you. You know what? Screw you, snake. I'm gonna restart again. I can probably do this better. Ugh. Boom. Why aren't they dying? Die, have a feast. Yeah, it's awesome. Oh gosh darn it, I hate these guys so much. The stupid snakes. This part is the worst. Gosh darn snake. Oh my god. The snakes, man. I'm Indiana Jones right now, I hate snakes. You know, I wonder, why isn't there Spear Kirby in this game if there's a banana level D? Did they want to make it unique for him? I don't know. 
You should be able to at least play as Bandana Old Eighty as player one, though, in my opinion. Even though he's not like useful for anything as player one, like you should still be able to. Oh, gosh darn it. I'm not doing this right. Okay, snakes. They are the first to go. Oh, my God. Freaking snakes. They are the first to go. I will kill all of these snakes. Oh yeah, what if I just increased my power? I mean, I don't think that would help that much, but... I mean, it could. Also, I need an amiibo. To heal me. Just in case. Oh my god, these stupid monkeys. I did worse than the first five. Didn't I? Oh my god, I swear to god. How do I do this? This is impossible. You know what, I'm just gonna use the power up I have right now. Next, how do you do it? Maybe this power up will help me. I mean, the enemies die faster, so... I don't know if that's really the correct way necessarily, but... I mean, if it works, it works. I'm doing this literally as fast as I can. I don't know if there's any other way. Oh yeah, those enemies die so much faster. Hopefully it'll do well with dealing with the snakes, too. Oh yeah, those guys are kind of annoying as well. Because they take like a second to defeat. Oh god, the snakes are no issue now. Oh god. No, you stupid time waster. Okay, there. Boom. Okay, there. That power up helped. I, I, I beat it, didn't I? I figured out the trick. Cheat. Always cheat, fellas. That's the lesson of the story here. If you can use a power up in this game, do it. If you think it's too hard, because it's going to help, usually. Like cheating. Okay. Now let us randomly go back to world. Um, we're going back to freaking part two of this stream because I forgot some one for no reason. 
Oh wow, there's more missing Waddle Dee's than I thought. Okay, you know what? Let's, um... Bro, that really took 20 minutes? Okay. Um, hit him Waddle Dee's, make landfall. What? I don't know what that means. I'll have to just Google all these. Kinda of forget this level. One of the more forgettable worlds. It's just kind of a beach world. Okay. Make landfall on the Isle of Treasure. Let's see what that means. Oh yeah, next. Where is... Uh, actually, I should just Google... Hidden Rooms. Kirby and the Forgotten Land. To find it. I'm not sure... Oh wait, this guide is only talking about the freaking hidden rooms. I mean, the hell rooms. I don't want just the hell rooms. Where? How, how, how do you know about these ones? Because I want to find them. Link me a guide for the the other hidden rooms that aren't hell rooms. Yeah. Oh, bruh, it's at the end of the freaking level. Are you kidding me? Bruh, the Isle of Treasure. I mean, I guess that's probably fair enough. Okay, I think the Isle of Treasure is the secret room because this thing is in the background. Um, yeah, I suppose that's easy enough for you. I just don't want to be too annoying on you. Oh, really? I thought it was at the end. Okay, where's that third waddle dee too? I guess I don't have to look up a guide for that if you're here. I just don't want to, like, accidentally skip something and, like, the chat delay affects it or something. You know? Oh, take the left. Bruh, you have to enter a freaking world. Are you kidding me? Take the left and enter a world pool. Okay, I'll look on the left. That is not the right world pool. Um. Maybe like this left. Okay, maybe not. Oh, okay. I thought you meant like way on the far left. Yeah, I'm going forward now that you said that. Oh yeah, this room is big. So it's at the end of the room, huh? Now I can go. Oh, bruh. Okay, that's not the one. Oh, bruh. It's gotta be this one. I'm going to die by trying to go into a whirlpool. Yeah. It's like a game of Marco Polo over here. Oh, God. Uh. 
Oh, okay. It must be like really well hidden then. I am not even trying to go into the whirlpools. Okay, I'm just kind of leaping around like an idiot. Oh god, okay, well I'm over here. I just want to get through the level faster and I keep getting sucked in the whirlpools. Hmm. I don't really see anything different about this one. Okay, it has to be around here. Underneath the whirlpool. I mean, maybe this one? Probably not. Yeah. We just getting killed out here. Oh, maybe this one. Yeah, oh, bruh. How are they? These developers are so sneaky. Oh god, uh, okay. I wasn't prepared for this. This is one of the, like, way more well-hidden waddledees. Assuming there's a wall D in here, I mean. Oh wait, this is just a hidden room. I don't think there's a Waddle D in here. Pretty neat secret though. Okay, um I don't think I hear a Waddle D in here. So I'll just keep going. Yeah, that, that was it. Okay, so I need to get this third Waddle Dee and make landfall. I don't believe the Waddle Dee is in this room, right? And I, I presume I get nothing for fighting the rooms, they are just fun. Ah, uh, nope. Okay, you know what? Now that I looked up the guide on this, I actually kind of see it. That's pretty clever. I probably would have noticed it if I looked more closely. Yeah. Aw, oh, look at this guy, though. Oh, you get both of them at once. Boom. Two and one. That's That was a well-hidden one. Go to trick. Okay, now I can defeat the level freely. Boom. Let's speed through it a little bit. While also killing all the enemies because fun. Ow. Must be fun replaying all the levels again with the upgraded powers, probably. Woo. Let's go. It's good seeing Elphalan again. Okay, now for the next guy. Model guy. Okay, I didn't really get most of these guys. So I'm just gonna chill here. Three tins of fish. 
two waddle -dees. I think I got like two out of the three fish or something. And to win the battle without falling in the water, I can do that. Not really sure where the Waddle Dee might be, though. The other things kind of sound kind of self-explanatory. Oh, a woofy sand sculpture. No, there's nothing over here. I probably shouldn't be looking up a guide, I think. Guy's not dying. Good music, man. Wait, where's the frickin' tuna? There is the tuna. Oh, it's in a hidden area. Okay. Beat the boss. Oh, I see. Okay, bomb would have been more helpful. You know, I, I don't need an ability. Psych. These blippies do be jumping. And there's a bomb block somewhere I he missed, I think. Alright, I also have to get both tunas. Second ten of fish isn't until the third area. Oh, Mavra, I must have missed that. Dang, that's that's clever, man. There's a bomb block somewhere around here. Oh. Wait, did I, is this the one I missed? 
Wow, I don't know how I missed that. If I did. Yeah, I, I think I missed this. Okay, I have no excuse for missing this one, though. It's kind of obvious. Oh. Okay. Oh, it's a timer. Okay. Boom. Ah, crap. It's a maze? Okay, we got them. Um, now I can destroy these guys without worry. Dang, they don't even put coins in here? Come on, man. Give me some coins. Okay, now I just have to find all the tuna. I know it says tins of fish, but it's just tuna. Man, the music in this game goes hard. True. That would be ridiculous. Okay, there is a tuna somewhere here, so I will find it by looking at a guide because I'm a little baby. Oh, um, it's just up the stairs. It's probably one I already saw. One more. Wait a minute, which one did I miss? I thought I got all of them. The first time I played this, because I remember specifically that third area. Like, you are in a whirlpool, it's all like swiveling around. Maybe I missed the one at the beginning? I doubt it, though. Oh, I just noticed my window is covering the whole screen. That's probably bothering someone. I have to fix it. There. As excited I was for the new cutter, I didn't really use it a lot. Like, I thought it was pretty cool, but... I didn't really use it. Oh, uh, we got it. Okay, now we just gotta beat DDD. And that's all the waddledies we got around here. Sure, it's free money.
I don't feel like it. Oh yeah, see, I didn't see this part. Next part, so that should be cool. Oh, this is DDD. Again. Oh yeah, I had the Waddle Dee the whole time. Here, you can take it. <laughs> yeah, these mission objective Waddle Dees don't really make sense, in my opinion. Like, the ones you find a level, sure. But why would I find a Waddle Dee by finding a freaking three tins of fish? Do, am I feeding them? No. Why am I fighting a Waddle Dee by going between the gorilla's legs? Was he in his butt the whole time? Ridiculous. You can probably make up a ton of stories for involving these missions. To where the Waddle Dees might be. I should go back to Waddle Town to get a power up. I could use um drill again. I mean, it should be easy. Wait, I have exactly two ninety nine and not three hundred. That is. Annoying. You know what? Let's use this one. Get myself a free power. Alphalon is just watching, like, um, what are you doing? Wait, what? A if I keep using this, can I just keep getting random powers? That'd be cool. Like, what if I kept using it? Yo, okay. That's, that's, that's kind of base. To gamble. Will I get power up? No. Come on, give me something. For free. Yeah, I just want power too. Yeah, you don't really need to stack up unless it's the arena or something. I think I'll go drill again for old time's sake. Honestly, I saw the post seething and rage because sleep wasted a slot on 12, one of the 12 abilities in the game, and I'm like, relax, man, all the other abilities are really good, like, who cares? They're like, oh, sleep is garbage, either give it a pillow, or don't replace it with a good ability. Like, it's sleep, man. Are you really that bad about sleep? Come on. It's sleep, Kirby. Okay. He's sleeping on this ability, man. Ah, oh, crap. I can't fast dig everywhere. Oh, yeah. You know what? I could also use sword, but that's not as safe, is it? Okay, so you have to prepare to get your mind blown. Also, there might be spoilers, because I'm going to do the arena later. Dun, dun. Yo. I'm gonna watch that again. Yo. 
How did I get hit? I was under the ground. Are you saying he can hit me regardless? Oh my god, are you kidding me? One fr one second in, and I get hit immediately. We love you, DDD. Okay, I'm not messing around now. Bruh, oh my god, what the? Why did I do so much damage? Are you kidding me? Okay. Oh god. Okay. Close. This is probably one of the easiest bosses, just because of how quickly he dies. Okay, I will beat him. No. Dead. We got him, boys. He he's no more. Easy, boss. Uh, just cause I get it up. Someone's on the phone, so I'm trying to be quieter, so I'm Hello. keeping it unmuted unless I'm saying something capo. Surprised there's no waddledies here. We got um Wait, what? I thought okay. Didn't know I was missing one here too. Weird. Okay.
Oh, that one. That's easy. I must have forgot about it. Reminds me of the horrors I had when I was doing this level. Why was it so much faster than when I first did this level? Did my car get stronger or something? Oh wait, it's because of the speed. Speed boost. I think? I don't know. My bruh. I could have just cheated the whole time. These power-ups are OP, man, I swear. Capo. This one is kind of ridiculous because you don't, th you wouldn't think that you would need the freaking invincibility candy for a boss when you get it, it's just for fun. Needs to get it the intended way, not me, obviously. I know which room. I know which room it's in because I watched my brother play this level recently. Because he was getting the wall of these too, so I was like, oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, I just kind of knew from that. So is there any reason I should be saving my coins now, or do I just need the stones for the power-ups? I wonder.
Yeah, I was thinking of using them on figurines, because I'm not sure if I'll need them as much for the powers now that I got all the regular upgrades. And we did it. We got all the Waddle Dees of the base game. And not the post game. Bro, that guy again? Come on. It's just a bunch of lame stuff. Wow, seriously? Nothing being like, oh my god, you've got all the Waddle Dees. Or maybe it'll be like that when I freaking go in the town, I don't know. Oh wait, what? Huh? Oh, there must be some other upgrade I'm missing then. Let me just check all these. Oh, okay. Thank you. That's the celebration I was waiting for. Yo, you got Alpha and Statue. It's Pog, man. Oh, Kirby. Yo. They're beautiful. This is basically the new Super Mario, but there's two rewards, though, not gonna lie. Kappa. But, I mean, it's a cool reward still. They look nice. Oh, it looks like we got a present for it, too. Oh, never mind. I think this was just from dying on something. I forget. They're calling me a scrub, Kappa. I kind of wish you could sell noob figures, not gonna lie. But, that's okay. Honestly, the same thing I've always thought with Smash Brothers. You should, you should be able to sell your dupe trophies. There's no reason to have multiples of them. Like... Okay, what special one am I- oh yeah, I'm missing several special ones, cause... 
I have not bought a single thing from this tomato guy. He's absolutely worthless to me. I have not bought a single thing from him. Like, I'll just buy a bunch of cake. It's cheap. It's affordable. Let's go. Oh, wait. I should buy it here for, um... Yeah, that's adorable, not gonna lie. Oh, look at these little fellas. Can I just keep buying cake to get it? Or, I don't know. I'm gonna buy a cake. Oh, come on. Give me your figurine. It doesn't have to be tomatoes, right? Do I have to buy, like, one of every menu item? Test. He's still not giving me it. You little- okay, you know what? I'll buy the tomato. If that's what you want, I'll buy one. He still didn't give me it. I'm- I'm crying. He's gonna- he's gonna rob all my money. What is he doing? I'm guessing it's like 10 items or something. Oh, good. Let's go. The short order cook loved the to feed his fellow waddledees at the cafe in town. He even kept them fed up as they crashed in the new world. His cooking smelled so good, smelled so good, which is how the beast pack found them. Now that the cafe has been rebuilt, it's time to get to work. Um, who else am I missing? Probably the item shop guy. Well, here we go again. Let's find an exuberant amount of items. I'm assuming this guy is a figurine too, anyway. This is what I'm saving my coins for. Bruh, it just despawned instantly. Oh, okay, good. Now we was faster. This enterprising world, he opened his own item shop in town. He sells special items that will help you out. He also supplies the cafe with an energy drink that he makes by hand. They have a special business arrangement. Two energy drinks for three Kirby burgers. 
Oh, so he's the one that makes it. Right, he's eating all the Kirby burgers. Okay, what other special characters am I missing? We got all these guys, but I'm missing somebody still. Oh, wait, what? I've entered plenty of present codes, are you kidding me? I didn't even know it tells me how to get them. Oh, okay. I didn't even know about it. These things are well hidden, man. I mean, I wondered why the beast stop, pack stopped attacking left this town alone? You certainly helped when you arrived, Kirby, but the Waddle Beast told me that Meta Knight has been fighting to protect the town on his own. He keeps watch day and night. He's even doing it right now from that perch up there. Gosh, Meta Knight is so strong. It's so cool. Alright, he's a Meta Knight fanboy. Something is written on this wall. Thank you, Meta Knight. Is, a hidden, is this a hidden present code? Bro, I actually think I already entered that. Just from searching. The list of present codes. I'm kind of a cheater. As you can tell from these... ...streams. Okay, let me... I think I did thank you, Kirby, but maybe not Meta Knight. I don't know. Okay, that works. This beautiful delivery D works for Waddle D deliveries in town. He gets helpful items to your doorstep with lightning speed. Kirby's handwriting makes it hard to read the present code sometimes, but this kind soul approves the orders anyway. Bruh, that's adorable. Yo, okay, that's a good present. Wait, does it have to do that for every single... No. This is a certified Zelda moment. Pick up a one green ruby and it'd be like... Kappa. Original Skyward Sword be like, you got a rupee. Okay, I guess I'll get something with that. Oh, wait. Look, Kirby, that photo was taken when the whole beast back came to say hello. Let's make a bunch of unforgettable memories and fill this wall with photos. To get away your house with it. Yeah, I know. Okay, um. guess I'm just missing these. Boom. Oh, actually it does tell me. It, it, it at least lets me know before I go back to the crank. So, that's some notification. Just not in the traditional sense, like, you do it and then it's like, You got all of them! Congratulations or something! 
Let's look at all the new ones we got. Which is, I don't know actually. They only have descriptions for the new enemies because lore. Yeah, but I want to look at the, the designs, man. Look at how beautiful that flower is. Beautiful. They really put, like, green into the star block. It's hyper-realistic now. I don't know why, but I kind of like the, the Warp Star from the older games more. Like, this one looks kind of funny. I like the shape of the Warp Star in, like, Kirby Air Ride and, like, the GBA games or something. It's got, like, a more compact shape to it. It's more flat. It doesn't have, like... Like, this Warp Star looks like a piece of candy or something. I don't know. Like, with those edges to it. Watermelon. It looks good. Chica from Love Live would be like Mekon. I know it's not a Mekon, but close enough. Whenever I see this type of melon, I just think of Yoshi story. Because I've never seen those in real life. I've only seen watermelons. Oh wait, green. Green coin. Okay, that's it. Let's get some of the volume too. Oh, it has a little crown if you got it too. Oh, this one's more money. Yo, that's adorable. Oh, I didn't get that. Oh crap, I didn't read the thing. Cake mouth, Kirby. Ah oh, crap. All these are the same as the weapon shop description, so I don't need to read them ever. Mookie. <laughs> Look at his mouth. He reminds me of Donkey Kong. What a happy little ape. Smile and dance, Mookie. Watch him swing and throw his little hammer around. You can tell he's happy to see you. Just look at that smile. Huh? That's not a smile? He's trying to scare us? Well, uh, it's working now. Yikes. Bruh. I bet Elphilin made that description. Yo. I think this is better after I beat the game because it brings back all the memories and treasures of the story. I like the bomb guys. They remind me of the GBA games because that's where they're from. Macaron. Chocolate bar. Coaster Mouth Kirby. Kirby Game. Oh, wait. Okay. I can't. I, I never have to read the first part. It's always copy pasted. Now he can stuff a entire roller coaster into his mouth. Bruh. Don't claim to be a Kirby fan unless you can stuff an entire roller coaster in your mouth. That kind of rem reminds me of the freaking Jigglypuff. Or. Jigglypuff copy pasta, I think. I don't know. Because it belongs to rails. To tilt left or right to dodge. 
Everybody strap in because the spaceship Wonderia is blasting into the future. Whee! Blooming flowers. Scarfy. I like how the first thing I did when I saw him was try to make him angry. Yo. Oh, they have names? Yo, you know what that means? They're not real characters, but maybe, just maybe, I can put them in Mood Eye, right? Come on, they're mascots. One dog and one, I love them. I like how the first thing I think when I see a new character is, oh, this person's in Mood Eye. Brain rot. Oh yeah, that fan art was so funny. <laughs> When Darius founder based the park's most popular characters on their own two dogs, one dog and Wendy. These two friends travel through the cosmos together in their stories, working as a team and having all kinds of wild adventures. Wow, no. Hey, it's only Gintama 5, but it's characters that nobody cares about, but Kirby fans care about, like, all characters, okay? You wouldn't want to get one dog and Wendy? Come on. It's one dog in one day. Mysterious Vortex brought Johnny and Edge to the New World too. They arrived before Kirby and fell in the ranks of the beast. Wait, how is this guy allowed in the beast pack? But not the tree. He's, he's not even a beast. He's a suit of armor. What? Kappa. Despite the wild war charm change, they really stand out among the rest of the pack, but they'll still guard their stations with ferocity. I think these guys are racist against trees. I don't know about you. Tin of fish. Brings back memories of five seconds ago. Pumpkin. Never seen a green pumpkin, actually. Spook step. Wait, he doesn't have a description? Isn't he a new enemy? Or was he in, like, Triple Deluxe or something? Um, spook step. I think he might have been in Triple Deluxe, actually. Like, the frickin' spooky levels. Bruh. I googled spook step and the first result was Underkill. Oh yeah, they were from Triple Deluxe. I kind of forgot about them, to be honest. I thought they were new enemies. But I mean, I don't think they... Yeah, they didn't appear in a game after Triple Deluxe, so I didn't really think about them. That's why I forgot they were only in that game. Okay. Shoulder panel, we already have that. Clunk. You don't... I, I love that freaking name, Clunk. Tropical Woods. Fresh ocean air and warm sunlight help Tropic Woods grow. Wait, his name's Tropic Woods? I thought it was Tropical Woods. Go big and strong. Giant coconuts will cause big explosions after they drop. It has non-exploding coconuts too. They're supposed to be delicious. Few have ever tasted them. M many have tried. Bruh. Squishy. Mm, fair enough. Okay, maybe like two more. Yo, Wondaria statue. Wondaria was named after its founder, an author who wrote stories about a dog that explores outer space. The stories became incredibly popular when Lady used as the basis for the Wondaria theme park, a land of dreams for kids of all ages. Oh, but not adults. Soft drink. Volcano fire. Okay, like two more. Crab. We're gonna more be a sweep all these figures. Okay, there. Okay. Yeah, I've been trying to get new ones because honestly, none of these were like. For some reason, I barely I had like six figures from volume two, freaking like five from this volume. And like, four from- none from this one, but that's because I just got it. And I'm still missing six from this volume, like, why didn't it give me any of these? For no re- it didn't give me- it just gave me dupes most of the whole game, honestly.
Uh, I'll get those later. Florina. Florina always puts on an elegant show. An elegant show when she attacks. Don't get too caught up in her performance, or you'll get caught up in her training or her match. She's very dedicated to her dance career and thinks of every battle as a new lesson. They keep her on her toes. Yeah, I know that, but... Okay, um, I guess now that I spent like 10 minutes getting capsules, I should do the arena now. However, first, I should probably upgrade one of my weapons now that I have enough stones. However, which should I upgrade? Should I upgrade a hammer or among us, Kirby? Because I feel like these are the two best abilities in the game. The others are pretty good as well. Like... Drill, and um, sword, and fire. Those are among the top ones, to me anyway. For me, it's, it's a toss-up between Mast ha Oh my god, that's a lot of money. Mast Hammer or Space Ranger. Don't know if Space Ranger would be as good an upgrade, honestly, but... Hmm. Well, that one's more rapid fire, so... I guess this is the best one. What do y'all think I should upgrade? Yeah, Mass Hammer. Honestly, whenever I do the arena, ma Hammer is like one of the first things I upgrade. So, like, I mean, not upgrade. I mean, I always use the hammer first in the arena in, like, every game ever. Boom. We're gonna make it stronger. Boom. Yo. Let's see how strong it is against this freaking guy. Yo. Okay, that's like way strong now. How much is it to increase this? Oh, no power-ups. No, I want to power-up sleep. It's my favorite ability. Really? Why do you need five? You can't even- you can only use this ability once! I bet all of them are the same price. I wanted to power-up sleep. Oh, uh, no, this one's three. This one's two. It must be on, based on how, wait, how is that only two? What? How is Meta Knight Sword only two? Isn't that one of the best ones? What? Oh, multiple time, are you kidding me? That's gonna be annoying then. This one is three. I'm gonna have to grind so much arena to max these out. I don't know if I would max them out, but I mean, I can. It's like freaking getting all those extra costumes in Mario Odyssey. Like, they exist, but like, why would you want to get them? Other than like... I don't know. By the time I beat the game, the costumes, like, came out after, so, like, I didn't have any reason to go back and grind the game out and get costumes, so I was just like, okay, they exist. Like, I never got the- oh, hi. Didn't see you. 
Sorry we disappeared on you, Flower Lion. The space through that tiny vortex is so weird. It's made from powerful psychic energy. I think I've been in that place before. It felt just like getting absorbed by my other half. The young guy must be stuck in that mysterious space somewhere. We'll keep looking for him in there, okay? Just hold on a bit longer. Dang, she doesn't talk. She doesn't react to my attacks either. Don't worry, I'm sure we'll find Leangar in there. Once he returns, your pack will finally have its old leader back. Just hang on a bit la- Wait, why would they want him back? I mean, like, isn't he evil still? I don't know. Probably. But the other ones don't seem so bad now for some reason. Like, why are they good? Like, is it, was Leangar just controlling them all or something? Like, I don't know. Lore. I'm sure I'll figure it out later, though, once I play the frickin' arena or something. Okay, nerd waddle -dee. Let's go. Bruh, that's the first thing they show me? I hate that thing. I'm terrified now. Come on, man. Okay, well, this is the ultimate cup. So we're gonna fight the strongest... Of the strong, and there might be, um, and there might be, um, spoilers for later bosses, but that is okay. Why can't I just walk in and pick one? I don't see why I have to talk to this Waddle Dee. I mean, I get it for, like, universe lore, like, fun purposes, but, like... Hmm... I mean, for the sake of just beating everything up, I think... I will... Wait... Oh, no. No. Go back. It didn't save that. Go back! It didn't save! I thought I didn't use it yet. True! Okay. Also, I'm wearing my Dragon Ball Tournament of Power shirt because I felt like it fit. I mean, we're doing the arena, so... Like, it works. How did I already spend an hour and a half? I didn't really even do anything. Other than go back to a couple random levels. Do 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 Max power! Let's go! Ultimate power! We will destroy all the bosses now. Oh my god, look at Mennonite, he's so cool. I didn't even see him the first time. Also, apparently, there is um, a, a secret if you... Um, wait, I cropped off part of the screen, I think. Wait, no. Uh, I guess I didn't look like I did, though. Because part of that Waddle Dee's face on the right was missing. Okay, there. Anyway, apparently, you can swallow Mennonite Sword, and he'll pull out his original yellow recolor sword from Kirby's Adventure. So that's pretty neat. Let's go, Ultimate Cup. Boom. Oh, I'm not fighting monkey anymore. Well, I mean, I'm fighting a monkey, but not the monkey. Bruh, one hit. One hit, dead. Well, that's because I have all these power-ups, but I mean, hey, it, it works. It 
It works, okay? Oh wait, crap, I forgot. Definitely 100% get the game and play it. It is very fun. Although I still have post-game content to do, like that extra world I saw, so... We will start on that after we beat the arena. Bruh, I'm killing Monkey! I killed Monkey! Yeah, definitely go get it when you can. Bruh, I'm so OP. I almost feel bad. But hey, blame the Waddle Dee. I had to get his figurine. Oh, he still does that. Yeah, Mario Strikers looks awesome. Oh no. Bad, bad memories. I will kill you instantly, cat! Oh, I just got the, um... Oh wait, crap. Boom. No damage so far, so that's cool. Meow. Boom! Let's go! You see the true strength of this attack upgrade by doing this. I won't have it for much longer though. Um, no. I don't want your sword. Okay, you know what? I have a plan. Oh, br you can just stand there and be like, no, I don't want it. That is so rude. Whoa, ow! I didn't know you could destroy it. Ow. He just knocks my power right out of me. Boom. Yo, Meta Knight's so cool. Oh, um... This is just that Mario Party minigame. Easy. Oh, bruh, what the? I guess that's to penalize me for camping it out. I can't camp out too long. Okay, you know what? Screw you. I'll just attack normally.
instead of charging my freaking test. Okay. Easy fight. Go. Dad. Dad. Now we will fight this guy from Rivals of Aether. Let's go. No, y'all haven't probably play that game, but it is pretty fun smash like game. Die. Ow. Ow. Give, give me my power. Yeah, I was thinking of doing it for like the last boss or something. But probably too late now. Okay, that didn't like do anything. Oh, well, good thing I have to not I don't have to do no damage on this guy. He's crazy. Yeah, but I need all of my tomatoes. For good luck or something. Uh, now for the most terrifying thing you've probably ever seen. In, his li in your life. Honestly, this isn't really a boss fight. It's more like just an experience. This, this thing. Terrifying. Okay, now for the real final boss. I don't know if Hammer will be very effective against him, actually. But let's watch the cutscene again. He's cool. Let's go, Facto El Phyllis. Or as some people call him, Fec Facto Amogus. No, nobody calls him that. Ultimate Life Form, is she Shadow the Hedgehog? No. Oh, I don't have any more power ups. Oh no. Boom. Oh my god, you you're one attack from you and you Boom. Yeah. I don't... Elphilus, I can kind of identify as a mouse, but I don't really know if this is a mouse still. I mean... It looks significantly less mouse-like. I don't know what it's supposed to be. Also, the design honestly kind of reminds me of, like, Lucario or something. Or, like, a Pokemon or Digimon. I don't know. It looks like a Digimon. Oh god, I think I'm supposed to jump over that. Oh, you suck. Okay. How am I supposed to tell? Oh, bro. I'm, I didn't see that until it was too late. Okay, well, whatever.
I am not good at picking up little details all the time. That's okay, he'll die just as easily. Oh gosh. Ah, you little... Boom. There is no point to this attack. It's easy to dodge. Dead. Yo. Oh, our beloved pink football is the last one standing. Our last fight of fighting, Kirby wins! Yo, that's a lot of star coins. Bruh, you only get one stone? Oh, nice. Hecto Elphilis, Ultimate Life Orb. The Elphilin we met was first born from a small, compassionate soul that hid behind greater, invasive ambitions. I've heard comparisons to this and Void Termina because, like, apparently Kirby is also one half of Void Termina, and Termina is like the Eldritch Abomination, and then Kirby is the normal one. And then Elphilin is like the normal one, and this is the Abomination. Without a soul to temper its power, the creature's spatial teleportation ability ran amok, opening mysterious vortices left and right. Now that they're whole again, they're already planning their next mission. Wait, what do you mean? Their next invasion? What do you mean? He's back? But he... he how is he whole? Did he take... Wait, maybe he took, um... What's his name? Leon Gar's soul. I don't know. We have to save Leon Gar. Okay, you know what? I think that's a good segue, because... I mean... The mission is probably save Leon Gar's soul. Oh gosh, okay. Let's do some of this, I guess. Oh wait, actually, not yet. Oh, bro, that's outdated. Why would it tell me when I already did that boss fight? This lore doesn't make sense. Okay. Um, before I do any of that, I will do the Hell Room. Hell Room. Um, let's see. Okay, stage one, three. Let's go. I forgot about it, I'm not gonna lie. I was about to go to the secret world. Hell rooms and hidden rooms. Let's go. But wait, why is there one missing treasure room in here? How do I get it? Do I have to beat Leon Gar again? I don't know. I guess I'll find out later. Oh, you can see the arena there now. That's kind of cool. One, three. Okay, Rocky rolling at road. Okay, I have to get to the end of the stage. So I guess we are speeding through. I remember when I sped through this level the first time. Good thing we have an ability for that right here. If you want, you can tell me how to get to it, but... Because you looked at a guide to get to it as well, but... Up to you. All I know right now is get to the end of the stage. I didn't read the rest yet. Man, this brings us back to simpler times in this game. It gets so much better after the first world, honestly. Like, the first world is fun, and then it gets even funner. 
It gets even better, man. Na 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 Katamari da Masi Katamari da Masi Na 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 Katamari da Masi Imagine if they had ability stones or something cool. That would be something. Wait. I don't see any ranger. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. I thought you meant, like, near the end of the stage. So there's some steel boxes here. Oh. Okay. Melons. Um, something with steel boxes? Oh, wait. Hmm. Oh, okay. Um, don't know. Oh, Ranger's right here. Oh, okay. And then there's something for me to hit. Not that target in the background, but I honestly I want to see if I could get it from all the way over here. Wait, is that it? No, that was that was another part of the level. Get up on the trees back. I'm surprised I could hit it from all the way over there though. Oh, there's another one. Oh, whoa. That's awesome. I wonder how many coins I will get from this. Oh, hey there, Corban. Bro, this is a lot of steps. Yo, the view here, man. Oh wow, we're on top of the building. Oh, we got the like... We got the freaking Sonic off of it. Yo. I knew they'd have that song there. Wait, isn't this, um, Star Allies theme? Actually? I thought it was the uh, freaking Kirby's Dreamland song, but... No, it's Star Allies. Wait, I want to get all of those. Oh. I'm defacing how laboratories. Oh wow, that's pretty cool. I wish I knew about that then. But I wouldn't have used them anyway, because I usually just use the abilities they have throughout the levels anyway. So it's not that huge of a deal. Ok, 
Because I just, you know, I like playing the levels the way they're designed, so... I use the levels, the abilities that they give you. At least the first time I play the game. Later is when you do the ability thing. I'm kind of basic, and I just use whatever the level gives me. I don't, I don't go out of my way to get powers usually, unless it's like a boss. Good song. Wait, this song is for me. Is this Kirby Fighters? Why are they using the Kirby Fighter song? I'm just gonna sit here and listen. Bruh, they got like a melody of songs. I don't know this one. Okay, I think that's it. Yeah, there isn't much more to the song. Oh, bruh. Of course, they don't give me anything new, because I already got everything. Wait, what? Three, four, oh wait, you mean four. Okay. Let's go. Dream Parade. Oh wait. No, I want that guy, never mind. You know what, that might be faster than Tornado. And better. For speeding. Let's stretch in. I don't know, I want to use whatever ability is good for speeding. Boom. Imagine if one of these gave me a rare stone. That'd be nice. Wink. Okay. I don't remember where the car room is, but I'll find it somewhere. Oh, it's this one. Eh, sure, let's get the freaking figurine. It won't give me anything, but let's get it. Yeah, this one's pretty cool. It's freaking carnival. I don't know if you were here for this one, actually, so... Makes sense. Sure, why not? Let's get this guy. Get some free coins. I changed my mind again. Wait, where's the other one? 
or uh, milk. I now I realize why they have milk because they're freaking babies. I want to find the fifth one for no reason. I just want money. I want money, man. Where's the fifth one? Oh, bro, he was already here the whole time. Come on! If you don't hurry, you're gonna get crushed. Oh my god, this frickin' guy. That wasn't even worth it. Ow. Car room? I don't know if this is it. Let's see. Oh wait, no, that's not a bonus room. Uh, where is the car room? I forget. Oh wait, it's down here, I think. Maybe. Possible. Quite possible. Yeah, okay. So, 86. Why 86? Oh, wait. Okay. Actually, I think that was when how laboratories might have been established. Probably. Also, I didn't notice it at first, but... Um... Frickin', um, Elphilin, or Elphilis was missing for 30 years or something, and that's, like, almost, this game was made almost 30 years after Kirby's Dreamland, so that makes sense. Do I have to get exactly 86, or can I have milliseconds on the clock? Because I feel like it's going to be hard to actually get, if I have to account for milliseconds. 86? Was that the bite of 86? Milliseconds or no? I wonder. Yeah, I have to wait here until it says 86. And then I'll learn all the secrets of the FNAF floor. Obviously. Okay. Come on. Boom. Okay, it doesn't matter. Milliseconds don't matter. Oh, well. Technically not a secret room. I mean... If you want to be technical, because... It's just a secret part of this room, which is also a secret, I guess. But, it works. Let's get some free stuff. The first one was a little bit cooler, but I like the flowers here. That's kind of neat. Okay. Well, I guess that's it. Imagine I hit retry and then I lost all my buddy. Imagine if someone found that on an accident. Because they were just that bad at getting the time. Hell laboratory. Let me just How was found oh wait no. Actually, how was found it in nineteen eighty, so what does nineteen eighty six have to do with anything? Maybe... Oh, wait. 
I think 1986 might have been the year of their first original game or something. Because, like, before that, they made Pinball, they helped with Pinball on NES, F1 Race, Rock Rider, Balloon Fight, and that's it. Their first, um, self-made title was, um, Othello on the NES and Game Boy, so... I guess that might be what it's referring to, because... 1980 they were found it, but they didn't make their, you know, stuff for themselves until later. Makes sense. Looking up the Howl lore here. Don't really know much about them outside of Kirby, and them helping on a couple of random titles, like Earthbound, and, um... You know, like, part-time UFO and box void and stuff like that. Like, you know, the basics. Otherwise, they're kind of a mystery to me. I know they also helped with, um, Pokemon Stadium, I think. Some of the N64 Pokemon games. Honestly, I feel like there was a lot less world back level backtracking after one area. Like in World 4, I didn't really do it that much. In World 5 especially, there wasn't really that much at all. So, yeah. Four four near the tomato. Oh, okay, at the start. Shouldn't be too hard then. Wait a minute. Why can I stand here? Sussy. Is there a secret? Probably not. I figured there might be like a little coin. Oh yeah, they helped with um, the first two Smash games. Which, you know, makes sense. I think it's Sakurai. Also, I don't know if you heard of this CF, but did you know a remix of the Halberd theme from Kirby Superstar? An arrangement of the Halberd theme from Kirby Superstar won a Grammy at the Grammys. So based, man. Proud of you, Meta Knight. And Johnny Ishikawa, the famous Kirby composer. Both are based. Yeah, it's like actually awesome. Just, let's look it up. It's a pretty banging remix. Um, three, oh wait, four, four. One, oh, we're going to British. One, two, three. Oh wait. One, two, three. Oh no, wait. This level. Oh no. Yeah, it happened recently. This level gives me horrible flashbacks. Bruh, it's near the tomato. Could've told me when I was doing it, but I guess it, may want, it wouldn't have made sense because I, I, it makes more sense to find them all together. So, then again, it's whatever. Where is this Hal room? Hmm, something is sussy about that. Yeah, you, that's what I thought, too. I mean, if you knew, you, you probably would have told me about it, I mean. Oh, really? Okay, it's not a hell room. Okay, where's the secret room? Tell me your secrets, mystery man. Oh yeah, no, the next hell room's in Volcano World, but... Okay, nothing I can do over there. 
Maybe it's up here. Yeah, that sussy block looks very sussy. Oh wait, I can jump up there, can I? Oh, okay. Aha. Yo, this is kinda cool. And it's just another freaking volume one figurine, like, I don't need this. Okay, time to kill all those bosses again. Wait, what? What room? You, you kidding me? That was- that, that- I thought that was it! I thought it was just a chest! Are you kidding me? I thought they were just giving me a chest! Okay, I'm maybe stupid. Kappa. Oh no, there's a body count called We Love Marbles. I don't love marbles, so you must get perished. I hate marbles. Bruh, the band love reason is the same as his name. I didn't mean to do that, but it is funny. Man, I didn't think this would have a multi-layered secret, but apparently it does. Okay, where- Wait, I have to go in the frickin' window? Oh, okay. Um, wait. Imagine if it just let me skip the level. That'd be kinda funny. Wait, what? Where is it taking me? Yo. Wait, is this- This is different. Am I fighting a different boss? No. I don't think so. What is- why am I on the roof now, instead of the ground, though? That's kinda cool. Oh, that's kind of neat. Oh, bruh. Imagine if I freaking did the- um, what's it called? For Wild Frosty against this version. Oh, really? That's kind of neat. Playing like an alternate stage. I'm guessing, do they still have the Waddle Dees, I wonder? This looks the same, almost, but I'll try it anyway. Oh, yeah. Forgot that happens. Also, this is quite possibly the most mid song. Not that it's bad, it's just like, eh. Oh my god, you, you, you traffic ho- is the platform faster? Maybe that's what's different. Ah! Uh, oh, I didn't even... Yeah, it's like... I think it was like a two-square platform and not one.
Oh god. Okay, I'll just wait until it gets on the side. Easy. You wouldn't want to tell me about this secret anyway, because that would just make the level harder, Kappa. I mean, not on the first go-around of the level anyway, because I'd just be like, Yeah, why don't I just do this one? And then it would be hard. They also only give me one power instead of two against the bosses. Yeah, if you known about it, you'd probably be like, no, don't do this. <laughs> it's the same level. But, you know, doing it much later makes more sense, so it's all good. Oh, there's two of them instead of one. That makes sense. I'm still gonna beat them, though, because I have level 3 power. I did have level 3 power. What am I supposed to do? Wait around 10 years for stars? Got a taste of your own medicine. No, wait. I don't want to get hit. Oh yeah, the, the thing probably sinks faster. Oh, bruh. Uh, dang it. Okay, I lost my health thing, but whatever. I forgot I wasn't current, current Kirby. Come on! Oh god, it has ice. Okay. Boom. Money. Secret. Well, at least it gives me the good power up against him. Oh, come on. Oh, bruh, it turns into snow. That's cool.
Now it's gonna be faster. Wait, where's the car? Oh wait, it's at the end. Yeah. Oh man, now this is a lot faster. No! Okay, easy. Oh, duh. Still easy though. Oh, what's that? Oh, instead of the freaking bridge one, you just... They just did that. How oh, nice of them. Oh, actually... They made it easier because there's only one Frosty. Okay, never mind. Scratch that. It isn't. It isn't harder. It's easier. If only I knew that, I would have just did this. But I'm not salty about it, cause that just means I'm an epic gamer, and I beat him the hard way, not the easy way. Oh. Okay, never mind. This is the hard way. I thought, you know, maybe since everything else is hard, maybe they'll make that one easier. Okay, scratch it out. I'm completely wrong. I'm going to get pummeled. Why did I choose ice? Oh gosh. You know what? Just gonna do this. How do you freeze Frosty? You can freeze Frosty. Watch what happens when I use a spell I don't know! Moment. Okay. Oh wow, that's a lot more of a warning. Don't forget the thing this time. Oh wait, I forgot I have to use the freaking pipe. Annoying. Wait, what? It didn't even jump. Bro, I only got like one chance to do that. Are you kidding me? That's not fun. Bruh, that's so annoying. Okay. Oh my god. No. No. Fringe, yeah. Especially on the harder version of the level. Okay, there. Good thing I already know how to do it. Didn't really think about that. You know, I wonder if anyone will try to, like, be make this game into 2D. I mean, it probably wouldn't really work, but, I mean, it would be kind of neat. 
you'd have to rework a ton of puzzles. For sure. And the treasure rooms probably wouldn't work either, but... I mean, maybe the more linear levels would work, I don't know. Yo! The feast for Kirby. The feet fist for... You know, kind of annoying, hard version of the level, but... I mean, I got a lot of rewards out of it, so that's good. I got almost 2,000 coins. I mean, 1,000 coins. So, yeah. I'd say it was worth it. Nah, I don't think this is a one-off. They're, they're only just starting with this. This is a new style of Kirby. Oh, okay. Another gold one, huh? Oh, Fanta. That sounds like... I feel like it'll go, like, it'll do a triple lock to Robobot for the next game. Like, the transition from triple lock to Robobot. Like, triple lock is already a great game. Even better with Robobot. They're just gonna go that crazy with their next game. Probably. They can only get better. Oh, we got a primal wolfie. A re regional land wasteland is the birthplace of the beast pack, so it's no wonder the wolfies found there. Their found there are more wild than their far-off cousins. They're more aggressive in every way, from their bark to their bite. Their primal ancestors must be pleased. Pacto. I didn't read that one. Me. No. Alright, I skipped original wasteland. I'd say maybe play it, but I would also wait until maybe a little bit into the year, because I wouldn't want to play it. And then they are really like, no, and I was saying Robobot HD, and it's like, oh, you know, that'd be kind of awkward. I'd say maybe wait a little bit on Robobot. I doubt they would do anything with the Dreamland trilogy, but maybe Robobot. They might port it. You never know. Because that's a newer game. So it's easier to port. And do right. But you know, a remaster of the Dark Matter trilogy would be pretty cool. It's been, like... 12 years since the last Kirby remake. I thought that was would be a more recurring thing, recurring thing, but no. They never did one since Superstar Ultra. Like, come on, man. I want to see a remake. Make a cool remake again. I feel like Kirby's Dream Land 2 definitely deserves some sort of upgrade. Oh wait, why am I doing any of this? I don't even care. I don't even care. This is definitely the most open area in the game for some reason. You got Dreamland 1, Dreamland 2, Dreamland 3, and maybe Kirby 64 will remake it. All in one pack. The classic collection. No, they... No, knowing Nintendo, they just release one of them and be like, buy the others. It'd be, like, silly. Oh, wait, why did I kill that guy? I need him. Oh, well, there's more of them.
Ah, you well. Okay. You know, I figured this there might be a secret here, because, like, look at all this stuff. There's, ha there's gotta be one somewhere. Wait a minute. I already see it right here. Bruh, I knew it. I just didn't really look into it. Like, I knew that, lo that area was like, huh. Kind of sus that they put all this stuff here. But I never did it. Cool. Yo. Dang it, I wanted that guy. Oh gosh, they're doing this again. Oh, you have to actually work for your reward here, man. Bruh, you can't trick me with that. Okay, good thing I picked Cutter. I think that's more helpful. Oh god. Well, Needle might have been helpful, I don't know. Yo, so many coins and freaking volume one, I think, or maybe that's volume two. Wish I found that the first time, but that's okay. I might, like, stop for a bit and then come back after the next secret room. Just to, like, break it into two parts like I did with the other things. But I imagine you probably aren't. You might not be as busy today, so I imagine you can check out the next part later today. Like, after I finish. Because I think I'm going to have one soon. But I'll do this last hall room at least, and then... Pick it up again later. Yeah. Probably next, too. Um, it's in the factory, I think. Burning, churning, something. Yeah. Okay. This level was kind of annoying, not gonna lie. Bruh, wait, what? What do you mean, backtrack? Oh, wait, like, go back here. Okay. Now I know what you mean, I think. Yeah, I, re I remember where it is. I just was like, wait. I just kind of forgot where, where it was, but then I thought about it and I was like, oh, wait. This song reminds me of Kirby's Dreamland 3, kind of.
Okay, now go to the start. Yeah, I know definitely one of the one area levels kind of have to dream, return to Dreamland sounding like track two, and the return to Dreamland tracks kind of sound like Kirby's Dreamland three. Some of those tracks give me, you know, classic Kirby vibes. Who was gonna think? You know what? I'm gonna go back to the start. Like why? Oh, bro, are you kidding me? What? How? Who's gonna think that? Man, all of these are, like, impossible to find. Well, I mean, the only one we know about is... Right? I don't know. I like that song, though. A lot of Kirk Return Me's Return to Dreamland is from Kirby GCN, and we don't even know about it. Which is pretty cool. Like, I've seen posts that are like background elements reused from that game, too, and I'm like, oh. True. Oh. I don't know, honestly. I haven't really found, like, any of the Hell Rooms in that case, probably. Wait, do I need a power to break these? Oh. Yeah, I was gonna say, I need that. I like that I waited until the end to do all these, because it's like a secret journey to all, like, these levels I already went to, and then finding cool stuff. The secret stream. I like how they released Kirby Fighters 2 and then dropped this freaking banger right here. Yeah, the Moon one is the only one I know about, but, um... I mean, to be fair, you can't really have somebody enter the room in a 3D game unless they had, like, a bunch of platforms leading to it, I guess. Don't think I missed anything. Do I just go back now? No, listen to the music. Ah, oh. thought I would skip the level for me. Sad. Oh yeah, I should have just picked a better power too. Why was I thinking? They had all those abilities there. And I didn't pick any of them. What was I thinking? I can't even use this one here. Oh, yeah. I don't know if you saw all of the freaking Volcano World streams that I did next, but... This freaking level was ridiculous. It took me... Okay, wait. Let me just show you here. I just want to show you. Uh, 
Oh yeah, I want to make these moves slower. That would have been cool. It took me forever just to freaking figure out how to get up to this platform to get this waddle dee, and all I had to do was stand over here and then float. Like, I thought I had to fly from either on the freaking floating one, or from, like, over here. Like, I kept trying to go from right here, because it looked like you could reach it, but you couldn't. Like, you'd think you would have to go from here, because it's, like, right next to where the entrance is, but, you know, he doesn't, he doesn't make it. It's sad. Okay, thank you, Tornado. Very cool. It should at least give me, like, coins or something for finding dupes instead of nothing. Like, what if this were Mario Kart Tour? They would give me coins for dupes, eventually. Come on, man. Wait, I'm going to die. I didn't... Oh, wait. Duh. The famous Mario Maker level hole in the wall. No, I'm just kidding. It's just the show hole in the wall. Is it me or is it a little faster? Probably not. They're not pulling a hard mode on me again. Okay, I'll, um... I'm gonna have lunch and stop for like 30 minutes or something. Oh yeah, you're right. My Mario Maker level does have lava, albeit not really used in any way. Just there for the aesthetic, because, you know, I figured castle looks coolest. Oh, mummy. Now you can start. Uh, this form turns you into a graceful glider that soars on the wind. Steer through tight spaces and use your spin tackle to swat away enemies. Enjoy your flight. Oh, wow, I got a lot of new ones, so that's good. Okay. Anyway, I'm gonna see you guys in like 30, 40 minutes. I don't know. That is if um, you're up for that soon. Up for it being that soon anyway. Because next time I will go to... Um... I know I don't have to go this way to do it, but like... I will go here. So, yeah. Actually, before I end off, I'm gonna just get some freaking... Wait, where is the Waddle Dee guy? Oh, wait, over here. I'm gonna get some present boxes. You don't have to watch this part, but figured I would do it while I'm here. Okay, present codes. Did I type Kirby's new desk? I probably did. Kirby's new desk. No, I didn't. Oh, wait. Kirby knew that's not Kirby's. I'm a fast typer. What? Eh, whatever. Oh, wait. News desk. I'm stupid. Okay. 
not Kirby's new desk card. I am not good at reading. Okay. Game news. Let's try that one. I get a rare stone for this one, so... Oh, Okay. Adventure guide. Most of them just give you coins, but... Some of them give me rare stones, so that'll be helpful for... Oh, rare stone. Oh, huh? Oh, bruh. I didn't pick it up. Kirby's new desk. <laughs> okay. I can't type the Japanese um, Kirby code because it, for some reason it won't let me type um, Japanese codes that exist. There's no Japanese option, even though it lets me do that on other things, I think. An adventure guide. Oh, Kirby Snacks? Um... Oh, I don't think that's on this list, actually. Oh, I've already used that one. Kirby Snacks. I don't know where you find that, but... I mean, I might as well cheat. I mean, all you have to do is look up the code. You don't have to find it in-game to actually use it. I think I did. your demo and um, I forget what the other one was no, no, no. let's try kill your demo now there's a couple more I believe that are ra random Oh, wait, what? I didn't use the demo codes? Okay. There's a lot of freaking hidden Model D Town codes too, but. Um, yeah, I think I. No. But. I think I cheated to get that one, probably. I don't know. Ah, uh, why can't I just get it? Like, immediately. Come on, man. First password. <laughs> More like the last password. Certified cheater.
Bruh. I knew about it, but I, I, th I guess I must have forgot, honestly, because I did know about it. So many codes. Well, at least we got a couple stones out of it. I hope we find more in the other world, too. use Kirby the Gourmet. Oh, no, I haven't. I wish I kept track of all the codes I use, because there's so many of them. Honestly, the Kirby burger looks a lot better than the cake. I wish the Amiibos gave you the burger, because it gets you the same amount of health, and it looks cooler. Um... Thank you, Kirby. I don't know if I did that one. We must thank Kirby for existing. Oh, okay. I'm gonna get a ton from this one. Yo. Oh, it's on the back of the Golden Kirby statue. Imagine there's frickin' Thank You El Fillin. Thank You Needy D. I'm gonna try something wild here. It probably won't work though.
Now that's not gonna fit. Dang it. Okay. Oh, alright. Oh, what the? No. Wait, weapon shop, where is it again? Oh, yeah. You just come see up here. Oh. Epic. Okay. Um. Yeah, I pretty much searched the town. I just didn't get any of the freaking codes. Because it's like, oh, go in this place and you'll find something on a wall. I'm like, okay. I think that is all of the codes. Um. Yeah, wait, what the? Was that Waldy well, holding a freaking banana? What the? Oh. Cool. Um. Yeah. Oh, what's this? I don't know what I'm doing right now. I'm kind of just messing around. Also, I want to get the code even though I already got it. Just to be fair. Oh, wait, I don't see it. Okay. We're good. Um, I'm gonna see you guys later, probably. Um, yeah. Probably, like, 40 minutes, 30 minutes, or hour, I don't know. Should be fine. But, yeah. Great stream, everyone. Thank you all for joining. And, yeah. It was awesome. <laughs>